Hi guys, welcome back to another webinar episode presented by myself, Kyle, a representative here at Gems by Pansis. And this month, we just want to go over Argyle Pink Diamonds and why they are so hot. The Pink Legacy. Um, this is a diamond that sold last November for $50 million. It was a record number pushing the value of Pink Diamonds to a new level. This, of course, created the attention of many investors and the general public piquing their interest. Obviously, people are interested in what this was all about. Pink diamonds are rare, one of a kind, and this stone can easily double in decades, which is why uh, an investor would want to buy something like this. Pink diamonds, where do they come from? Well, there's a few mines around the world. As you can see, there's mines in India, Brazil, and South Africa. But in this presentation, we just kind of want to note the Argyle mine in Australia because it produces 90% of the world's supply of pink diamonds and it is located in the East Kimberley of Australia. A real ro remote location in Australia. It mine The mining operations are 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. And uh, in today's world, we know of two types of pink diamonds. There's a type 1 which is typically an argyle material. And then of course there's type two. And there's a little bit of a breakdown here uh, in terms of sizes. So as you can see, most type one pink diamonds are less than a carat, the majority, where the majority of type two diamonds are gonna be between one and three carats. So in terms of the pink legacy, uh, it was a type two, but just to hone in on type one here, they typically come from a nitrogen rich area they usually have more purple, hence they're stronger in color. So a lot of the material that we know today out of Argyle is going to be more vivid and hence even red. So as you can see there on the screen, there's a red diamond. Um, these stones are typically smaller, so never anything more than five carats. Um, I think we've seen large reds out of the Argyle between two and three carats on record highs. So there you go, type one. And uh, type 1 will have strong to medium fluorescence, and it's not a bad thing. Depending on the fluorescence, it can help the color of the stone. Obviously, it can affect the haziness of the stone, but then again, all these factors play a role in value of that item. Type 2, here we go, pink legacy, uh, over 5 carats. They come from a nitrogen-free area. Typically, that means they're lighter in color, hence weaker saturation levels, and have a orangey hue to its color. These type 2 pink diamonds uh, have less fluorescence, or less likely to have fluorescence, and as you can see, the pink legacy there on the right, it's a more pastel-y color, and of course it's larger than 5 carats, giving away all the traits of a type 2 pink diamond. So why are pink diamonds so hot? So obviously, Last November, the Pink Legacy sold for a record $50 million to Harry Winston. Thus, it's created the interest, like I've mentioned. But also, Rio, who owns the Argyle mine, is closing the doors in 2020. Um, since the, the price of brown diamonds have lowered, decreased in value in the recent months, years, the profitability of keeping the doors open is, is becoming harder. So in mid-2020, they are shutting the doors down. Uh, and of course, this is driving market demand. A lot of people around the world, such as the collectors, investors, as well as consumers who become aware of this fact that pink diamonds exist, are all wanting to buy and become uh, a consumer of pink diamonds since they're so unique, one of kind, and exquisite. So the last slide here, closer look at the rarity. Uh, Argyle Mine is producing 70 carats of rough material daily of which 60 to 70 carats are actually pink. 90% of those stones are going to be between half a point and 14 points. So they're melee sizes, extremely small. Um, and of course, that brings us down to 0.5 to a 99 points, which is just under a carat, is less than 10% of their production. Meaning, anything that's over a carat is representing less than 1% of the mine's production, which means if you're getting a carat size plus pink diamond from the Argyle mine, it is extremely rare, guys. Very rare, which is why 
the price per carat on this type of material and the expense of owning one of these is a, is a high high value. So I want to thank you guys uh, for taking a few minutes to watch this webinar. You can find us on YouTube, Gems by Pansis, and subscribe. Also find us um, on Instagram. We have an Instagram handle, Daily Activity there, posting uh, product images of our loose diamonds and, of course, finished product. And you can also visit us on the web. I have the links below, www.gemsbypansis.com. Thank you guys and have a wonderful day.